Good morning, everyone. Happy New Year. I hope you guys had a great New Year's. It is now 2024, so I'm filming my empties from December of 2023. So let's just go ahead and get into it. I'm trying to get this done really fast before I have to start work. And I'm kind of quiet because everybody in the house is asleep. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, so the first thing that I finished is this body prescription scrub. This is in vanilla mint. So I didn't like this scent. I feel like it smelled like a bathroom, like a public bathroom, like the cleaner that they use or the air freshener. I don't know. Like it smelled nice in the container, but like when I actually started like spreading it on my body, it was just a scent that I really, really didn't like. I do still love the formula of the body prescription scrubs though. So I would buy them again, but definitely not this scent. So this one just didn't work for me. Next, I used up some stuff in Strawberry Pound Cake. This is some moisturizing body wash. This has scent notes of fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream. My absolute favorite scent. And I don't think that I have any more of these, which is sad. Except two of them. There is the two moisturizing body washes. And then I used up a lotion and a spray from Tree Hut. I used up this cinnamon dolce. This one is amazing. It's sold out everywhere. I would definitely buy some more. I think I have one more. This like smells like graham crackers. It is such a good scent. I love this one. This one's so, so nice. And I also used up this sparkling sugar. I think this is the one that they have at Ulta. So they have certain scents that they only sell at Target and then certain scents that they sell at Ulta. I wish they sold them all at Target because they're like $2.50 cheaper at Target than they are at Ulta. But this one smelled nice. I don't know if it was anything super spectacular, but it smelled good. Our hand soap, I used up this afternoon apple picking. Sit notes on this on the side, maybe right there. Crisp apple, succulent pear, and cinnamon just smells like apples, nice and sweet. And I used up a toasted vanilla chai. These one of these last months, and the scent notes are just toasted vanilla chai. <laughs> Super simple, but this one smells good. Used up among the clouds. Uh, scent notes of wild berry skies and with vanilla clouds. I just really, really love the scent. It's just nice and sweet. Like it's not super offensive or polarizing or anything. It's just a nice, sweet scent. Super simple. Also finished up the perfume in it. I have backups of this. So sad to see this one go, but I have other backups of it. So it's fine. And then here is the lotion. The cap is super pretty. I used up this bubblegum pop shower gel. This has scent notes of gumball sugar, candied fruits, and citrus bursts. Love, love, love the scent. It's one that I wish that they would bring back. Just smells like pink bubblegum. I used up this shower gel in snowy citrus swirl. This has scent notes of chilled tangerine, whipped marshmallow, creamy tonka bean, and fresh vanilla. It smelled nice. I remember when the body care came out, I didn't like it. Like it smelled spicy to me, but this one smelled okay. It just smelled like oranges. I mean, it wasn't super fantastic or anything, but I'm glad that's out of my collection because it was from 2019. I used up this coconut pumpkin latte soap. Has sit notes of coconut cream, whipped pumpkin, and warm praline. This one smelled really nice. I like this one a lot. Moisturizing body wash. I used up this summer melody. Has sit notes of golden honeydew and bronze vanilla. I love this scent. This is my last one of this. I hope one day they bring that scent back. I used up a set of pear creme brulee. This has scent notes of baked pear. Caramelized sugar and whipped cream. 
I love the scent. Some people love it. Some people hate it. And I'd actually had planned to use this in January when my project used it up, but I ended up switching it out for fireside flurries because I felt like I wanted to wear this one this month. And then I just put the fireside flurries in for January. So this one is used up. There's the body cream for it. In shower gel, I used up this violet leaf and blackberry. This has scent notes of fresh green violet petals and succulent sugared blackberries with powdery vanilla bean. A lot of people kept saying this smelled like blackberries and basil, and it doesn't. I think a lot of people try to make everything smell like a dupe, and not everything is a dupe. <laughs> and this one just, I think it was, it was a fine scent. It wasn't my favorite scent, but it was okay. We used up this lotion in Open Sky. Sit notes for Open Sky are fresh air, wild blackberries, soft violet, and a cloud of comforting vanilla. This was a nice scent. It's kind of like a fresh, sweet scent. It's not super sweet. It's just like kind of sweet and fresh. It's a nice scent. It's actually the first time I've ever used this, and I've had this for a long time. Here is the spray. The bottle is really pretty. In shower gel, I used up the champagne sprinkles. This has scent notes of sparkling champagne, raspberry icing, and rainbow sprinkles. I love this scent. It smells like raspberry like frosting. It smells so, so good. This is one that I wish that they would bring back. From Tree Hut, I used up this watermelon shave gel or shave oil. I love these. They take forever to go through, but... I'm definitely a shave oil type of girl these days, and I don't think I would ever buy anything else, so I love this one. I used up a set of blueberry sugar pancakes. This has set notes of sugar blueberries, fresh pancakes, and caramel cream drizzle. This is one of my favorite gourmand scents that they make. It just smells like super sweet blueberries. I absolutely love it. Here is the spray. This is one that I wish that they'd bring back. They brought it about two years in a row, but they haven't brought it out since. So it's a bummer. I used up a set of blush cardigan. This has scent notes of sweet raspberries, sugar dip violet, and warm amber. This is just a really pretty kind of perfumey raspberry scent. I really like this one. It was kind of one that I wasn't obsessed with when I bought it, but I actually, when I finally used it, I really like it. It's nice. For hand soap, I used up champagne, apple, and honey. Scent notes are pink lady apple, sparkling champagne, and autumn woods. One of my favorite scents. Also in hand soap, we used up marshmallow fireside. Toasted marshmallows, smoldering woods, and fire roasted vanilla. Just like the best smoky vanilla. Love this one. Used up a vanilla coconut bar soap. Like that one. That was a good one. And I also used up a Dream Bright bar soap. That one's nice too. Used up a set of snowflakes in cashmere. This has scent notes of vanilla cashmere cream, caramel woods, and frosted clementine. This is just a really pretty scent. Like it's sweet and warm. It's just a nice scent. It's classic. They bring it out all the time. Here is the body cream. Used up a set of coconut mint drop. This has scent notes of, oh, got French on here. Let's see. White coconut, iced peppermint, and winter musk. This is like the perfect blend of like coconut and mint. Like it's just a little tiny drop of mint, but it's just a really sweet, pretty scent. I really love it. I think I have one set of it left. Here is the lotion. We haven't seen this one in a while. Let's see. This is from 2020. Used up a set of a thousand Christmas wishes. This has scent notes of pomegranate prosecco, sweet elderberry, star jasmine, and sugar woods. I love this scent. It is super strong, but it's super pretty. And it doesn't smell anything like A Thousand Wishes. It's way more fruity. This is a really pretty scent. I like this one a lot. Here is the mist for it. 
used up a set of buttercups and berry bellini. This has scent notes of strawberry puree, buttercup flowers, and bubbly prosecco. This is one of my favorite strawberry scents that they make. Like that strawberry puree in there is just so sweet and I just love it. It's just such a pretty scent. Here is the mist. Also from Tree Hut, I used to have this bikini reef. This one's nice. It's nothing super special. I think this might have been my last one of this, but I liked it. It was nice. I used up this moisturizing body wash in Pure Wonder. This one has scent notes of iced rosé, star jasmine, and warm white amber. This is a really nice scent. It's very, it's like perfumey, but it's not like really heavy. And it's very clean. Like it smells like freshly like washed sheets or something. Like it's, I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> it's a very clean scent. And I really like it. It's pretty. It's nice for, I think it would be best in like the summer. Like a something like a really good like summer scent. I used up a travel set of Dream Bright. I don't have the scent notes on it, but I think most people know what it smells like. It's kind of like a perfumey berry scent. It kind of smells like into the night, but definitely a lot sweeter. Here is the mist. I finished up this Strawberry Pound Cake Lip Scrub. I did not like this one. It has glitter in it, as you can see. <laughs> um, but this wasn't my favorite. I don't have any more of these, so I'm happy about that. But I'm glad I finally got it used up and out of my collection. I used up one hand cream. It was in Strawberry Pound Cake. One of my favorites. For lippies, I used up this Pineapple Prosecco. That one was fine. Used up this Vanilla Bean Noel. That one was all right. And then my favorite, of course, is this My Favorite Night Balm. I use this every single night before I go to bed, and I use it every morning also when I wake up. And it makes my lips really happy. I love this one. And my final thing that I finished up is this Boardwalk Delight by Skylar, which is such an amazing perfume. It's like raspberry, cotton candy, and coconut milk. It is so pretty and sweet, and I just absolutely love this. I already have backups of this. It's a scent that I would always keep in my collection as long as they have it around, and I just absolutely love it. All right, there we go. They're all my empties for December of 2023. Let me know, what did you guys finish up this month? Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.